Hello, and welcome to another Drago's Persona Chat with yours truly. Hi! And it's me again for another voice act to talk about one of the Fan of Thief members who join up in the Royal Edition of Persona 5 and other roles to talk about. So this goes out to her. Don't forget to describe my YouTube page, ring the bell, and such to notify for other videos. Also, the petition thing for Persona 5 animation to have more of the Blu-ray and DVD box sets to go down in price from Amazon to and um, get out right stuff on those things from Vodan Nation and Anyplex. As well as join my group on Facebook for Persona Such to join in, see you on Twitter, and more YouTube things. Okay? This goes out to you. Next voice actor to talk about is Laura Post. Hope I can give you autograph stuff. And also see you at another anime convention in Westford, Massachusetts this year. Alright, for her work, let's talk about it. From Sailor Moon S, and of course, Crystal. Tulu from the Death Buster group. I love the original anime series of it. She does a fine job and a bigger role of a villain. Sailor Moon Super S, Queen Metallia. And if you have something else between that and stars of that villain, you'll see more if you watch it. Naruto Shippuden as ne uh, Neji Hyuga as the young age one. Let's talk about the past. Red Line as Boz Boz Boz. A rare name for a girl. Squid Girl, I definitely gotta check out. Skull Girls Fighting Game as Valentine Nurse and Elum, a weird masculine assistant. <laughs> I like how that's turned out differently. Star Online as Rosa, Rosalia. So I think I remember her, it's just been a while, but I've seen it. <laughs> and next to talk about is Kill a Kill as the other villain, Ryo, Rago, Yo Kiru, Kiruni. Oh yeah, that villain, <laughs> she was very good. As well as Matsuo Watari, Izenbo Fuguhara. Wow, she does from craziness to the main villain self. That's that's something. That takes a lot of work. She has a voice from Gundam: The Origins, Feili, one of the small roles. Yep. And what else? The Little Witch Academy looks very interesting to check out. Of course. Next to talk about is Hunter Hunter as Haruna. I think it's from the Chimera Ant Saga. Voltron Legendary Defenders as Commander Tur Turg. With two G's in it. And let's else. One Punch Man as Fu Fubuki. AKA Blizzard from Hell. Oh yeah, she's a really cool a really cool superhero type. She's like the youngest sister of the other one with tornado power. She's really cool. I mean really, she How do you get powers like that? It's, it's not that bad. It's awesome. It's also Justice League action as Big Barbda and Cyrus. A little different, you know, it's a cartoon version. Justice League Dark, the movie. Businesswoman is a small role. Fire Emblem Heroes as Sylvia and Catherine. Guns Zero as Rika Shimohira. Wow, well, punch one of Punch Man sagas to check out more when it happens. Lupin the third series is Nide and Leva. From the I think the fourth or fifth one, forgive me, it's just been confusing the numbers. Batman, the enemy within as Harley Quinn. Ooh, she actually did a very good job in that. I kinda surprised when we did just love her work here. Nicely done played as a villain clown. That's Joker's lover at times, weirdly. <laughs> just just saying. Um Octopath Traveler as the main players, Primrose Azhar. Oh yeah, that was good. She, I like that kind of a character. What else does she do? She also does the one of the sort of villains, the Promised Neverland, as Isa, Isa, Isabella. I'm not going to spoil anything much from that angle. You're going to have to see the rest for yourself. Oh yeah, and also Sailor Moon Star, Mira Pardir, Young Princess, uh, Helenia. Oh yeah, and she did a small victim with the small characters. Alice Izuki, aka Sailor Brewery. You'll see if you watch the Sailor Moon Star Season 5 saga. Kill a Kill If by Ragyo, villain in it. Fought her emblem, Three Houses. It's Catherine, too, is in that one. Maximilian Actress, the creators of Paranoia Agent, Paprika, and um, Perfect Blue. She voices Echo Shimayo. I checked that out because I heard the movie was good and finally dubbed. 
Cells at work looks goodly neat. Pokemon Masters is fair, Flannery and Cheryl. Nice. That's a lot of something. Demon Slayers as Tamayo. Is she that nurse lady whose curse helps out the good guys? That's a cool role to play as. What else does she do? Okay, here comes the big one, Persona 5. Royal as Kasumi Yoshizawa and Sumuri. Ah, ah, ah. Not gonna spoil there. I only get to say those two names and you have to find out the rest why. From my fan fiction story, she becomes Keiko's, like, friend and she calls her teacher. A senpai for in Japanese. And for such that Kiwa, my other OC male character, has a crush on her and knows the organization. Two other girls, AK and Hitomi, are also Persona users like Kasumi. If you want to know more, I'll reread the story of my fanfiction and you like it. Or just play the original game, which I enjoy very much as the best remake from the original. Of that character and such. Along with this cop joining in, this other guy, and another woman. If you want to know more, look it up. She is a good, interesting character. Hopefully she'll return later. She should have joined the dance form. But she was one of my finest roles in that. And it's really cool how she changes her voice tone. Which is awesome. Ghost in the Shell. S.A.C. 2045. As Ada... Brain Baron and Car AI. Huh, not bad. There's other things I want to check out too. Be an angel, brand new animal as Melissa Harner. Case closed, episode one. The great detective turned small as Vermont slash Cheryl Vineyard. Huh. How interesting. Junjun Kaisen as Mia Zuni and Tadaka. I say that fast. Also, the case closed the darkest nightmare as, well, Sharon again. I don't know how different names you have. Uh, I guess that's all the roles she has done so far, and that's pretty much all of it I can give you. But still, we love her role, and hopefully she does more, besides the persona thing, you know, this fetch. Well, that's a lot to say about her work. I wonder if she's going to do Qu Queen Helenia in the Sailor Moon Crystal two-part movie. I hope so. Anyways, that's all for today. Join next time. How the other voice actors and characters will talk about? I'll work my way around it, but it will happen. Thanks again. Bye-bye.